Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Good morning everyone and thank you for coming Education can make a person easy to lead but difficult to drive It can make it easy to govern but impossible to enslave And this is true because without education a man is just a shade better than an animal Thus, true education is the key to a happy life. Islam has a great heritage of knowledge. It has been flowing throughout. Many Muslim scientists, astronomers, mathematicians, and many other professionals have made many advancements through education. The Islamic education system is one of the oldest in the world. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, The virtue of one who acquires knowledge and imparts that to others. A long time ago, during the battle of Badr, the Prophet gave victory over his opponents and 70 people from the enemy rank were taken into prison. These people were literate people, meaning they know how to read and write. In, in order to uh, and in order to use the, the, their abilities, the prophet declared, if one prisoner is able to teach ten million children how to read and write, it will serve as his ransom, and he will be set free. This was the first school ever established in Islamic history, and was established by the prophet himself. And ever since then, we now know how important education is and how it, it, it must be received by everyone. I remember the day when I came into Aluda with hopes that I'd be able to master not only the non-religious lessons, but especially the Islamic ones. And Alhamdulillah, it has been two years since then. And I can say, on behalf of myself and the other students, we are now capable of implementing what we learn into our daily lives. Before I end, here is a quote from Nelson Mandela. Education is the most powerful weapon, and it can be used to, rule the world, to change the world. And on that note, thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.